What's up everybody, it's the one, the only, the Phenome, and welcome to part 32 of my Mass Effect 2 playthrough video series. Now, in the previous video we finally came back to the main story campaign of, uh, well, not, not the main story campaign, to the main story missions of Mass Effect 2, after finishing all the DLCs that, well, with the exception obviously of Arrival. And, uh, yeah, we went to the Derelict Reaper to pick up the Reaper IFF. To be honest, quite predictably, uh, the team who was sent to help, like the scientist team who was researching the Reaper, they were all gone. And as we found out, they returned to husks, because even even though the, der the Reaper was derelict, it was still able to influence the people on board, uh, because they were there for an uh, extended time period. They were still ma uh, managed to um, sort of uh, interfere with them, and uh, yeah, in the end, that we even saw a gruesome kind of what Shepard described as an altar. Um, oh right, yeah. I already talked to Joker, uh, but yeah, we saw even a gruesome altar erected with some impaled scientists there. So, all in all, uh, we did manage to retrieve the IFF, but that wasn't the most interesting piece of salvage we retrieved. We actually, there was there was a Geth sniper on on the Reaper, and uh, because of that, uh, and yeah, be actually because of the sniper Shepard is still here because he actually managed to snipe some. Uh, uh, some enemies who were trying to sneak up on him. So, um, yeah. Uh, but in the end, somehow, I don't know how you do this, but somehow a one of the husks managed to knock out um, the Geth, and we brought him back here. After a conversation, it turns out that this was a Geth from some sort of a Geth collective that wasn't under the control of the Reapers. And he actually pledged to fight with Shepard uh, on his side. And, um, yeah, we've accepted them into the team. Well, them, I guess, because there are multiple... Uh, as he said, there are over 1,100 programs installed or working in that platform. And so, with, from Edie's uh, suggestion, we named him Legion. Well, he was named Legion. And he gave us a mission. So, apparently, the heretics... Um, well, uh, as des described as heretics... The Geth serving uh, the Reapers, they have a plan to infect the Geth who still have their free will with a um, with a virus that would uh, make them have the heretic's logic. And in in turn, since they're machines and they operate sort of their logic is mathematics, pure mathematics. Uh, the virus would sort of introduce an error into their equations and uh, make them sort of follow uh, follow the reapers because they would think that oh okay yeah this is this is obvious like we need we have to do this this is in our best interests so now we're going to this heretic station in this uh, phoenix massing cluster in the sea of storms uh, system and this is where the heretic station is located and uh, yeah we're gonna. We're gonna destroy this virus, and I presume all to get on board as well. So Heretic Station. Once called Heritar by the Quarians, the space station was stripped of its useful technology by the fleeing migrant fleet when they left the Perseus Vale 300 years ago. A little more than a cold metal superstructure floating in the void, the station was removed from star charts by 2050 CE. Uh, scans indicate the station was reconstructed and, and upgraded in a massive effort. It must have taken at least 10 years, implying that there may have been some Geth outside the Vale before their infamous attack on Eden Prime. Needing little but a fuel source, it could have been hidden there, uh, hidden here for much longer without attracting attention from the barren worlds around Tasra or the clueless, clueless Elcor in the Salahiel system. Clueless Elcor. Heretic Station, as Legion refers to it, is home to a Geth data core capable of broadcasting vast distances through tight beam projection. Approximately 6.6 .6 million copies of Geth software are uh, stored in the station, the majority of which are kept bodiless in servers and downloaded to Legit platforms when needed. The station's population of Legit platforms is apparently approximately 2.4 million. So we're quite literally going into a hornet's nest. Brilliant. <laughs> Why wouldn't we? Why wouldn't we? Okay then. Okay then, let's see. Let's see what we can do with this. 
Alright, so Legion is obviously our required uh, character. Because I think this works kind of like a loyalty mission. And, uh, well, another tech-savvy guy is Garrus, so we'll take him. Because obviously we're fighting Geth. Also, Legion has 28 points. Nice. So we'll get some AI hacking for him. We'll get the uh, combat drone. And if we get these six points, then he'll have 11 left. So, um... Hmm. Yeah, we get Infiltrator. So, improved combat drone. Um, I think... Thinking of it, I'll take attack drone. It's gonna. I feel like that's gonna be more useful. And obviously, we'll upgrade this, so we'll give him Geth Assassin. I mean, gotta remember, if you you can take more health or more damage, but if you have more damage, you can kill things quicker, and they won't, you know, they won't take out all your health. <laughs> Logic. All right. So Legion. Ugh. Screw the Collector Assault Rifle, we're not working with those bastards. So the Incisor or the Viper, I think I'll give him the Incisor because Garrus is carrying the Viper. Yeah, he is. Alright then. You know, it's just our heat emissions that are hidden, right? They could look out a window and see us coming. Windows are structural weaknesses. Geth, do not use them. Approach the hull at these coordinates. Access achieved. We may proceed. Somebody must have heard that. Won't we be detected? Don't they have intrusion alarms? Sensors have been reduced. We have infiltrated their wireless network and filled the data storage with random bits. And that helps us how? The heretics must scrub this junk data. They have partitioned themselves into local networks, working in parallel. Any alarm we trigger will not go beyond the room we are in. Only accessing the main core will trigger a station-wide alert. We've got a job to do. Let's get to it. Shepard Commander. We concluded that destruction of this nation was the only resolution to the heretic question. There is now a second option. Their virus can be repurposed. If released into the station's network, the heretics will be rewritten to accept our truth. That sounds dangerously close to indoctrination, unless there's something I'm missing. And maybe this is how AIs settle religious disputes. The Geth are already a threat to organics, though. If we give them back their heretics, they'll get even stronger. Okay, let's uh, elaborate on Why this. Why didn't you mention this before we came aboard? We did not know the virus was complete. It is. It can be used against the true Geth at any time. Our arrival was timely. Okay, so that's good. They're your people, Legion. You must have an opinion. This is new data. We have not yet reached consensus. We will process as the mission proceeds. Alright. Rewriting is unethical. They're just machines. I wouldn't brainwash an organic race. I can't see treating the Geth differently. The question is irrelevant. If we do not rewrite them, we destroy them. That is why we are here. Do not hesitate now. They will exterminate your species because their gods tell them to. You cannot negotiate with them. They do not share your pity, remorse, or fear. Where did we come through anyway? Where's that hatch? Oh wait, I have to go this way. Ah, and that was the hatch we went through, which is still apparently being worked on, for some reason. So the alarm won't go past the... Uh, Together and active. Maybe we can sneak past them. Interrupting data streams will alert local network. We recommend preemptive strikes against hardlink routers. Ah, uh, sure. But yeah, don't step on these. That's, that's the pro tip of the day here. Also... We are in close range, but I will give these guys their high-powered sniper, sniper rifles. All right. So Go, Dad! 
Get him, boys. Get him. Don't want them to get up. Shepard, I'm picking up useful resources in the Geth Hunt. We could salvage them for supplies. Good point, Garrus. Thank you. That's Why are all the heretics oh. attached to these hubs? These are mobile platforms. Hardware. The crew is software. They are communing through the station's central computer. I'm not sure I follow. The heretics connect to the main computer to exchange data memories and program updates. We gain complexity by linking together. To be isolated within a single platform is to be reduced. We see less, comprehend less. It is quieter. If you exchange data, memories, how do you keep track of which ones are yours? How do you stay you? There is only we. We were created to share data among ourselves. The difference between Geth is perspective. We are many eyes looking at the same things. One platform will see things another does not, and will make different judgments. Hmm. I can see why you'd be conflicted about the heretics. In a way, whatever you do to them, you're doing to yourself. Yes. Once they return to us and upload their memories, we will share their experience of being altered. Every other species I know of might be psychologically scarred by a traumatic experience like that. It is not clear if death can be traumatized. We do not feel pain as you do. We cannot predict what the effects will be. Let's keep moving. Yes. Yes. <laughs> weapons. Uh, weapons drawn, boys. We can assume control of any defensive turret. They will assist us briefly, then self-destruct. Okay, good to know. Good to know. I'm assuming since they're here, we're gonna have some enemies here. Yep, there we go. Whoa! Straight through my shield. Brilliant. Absolutely amazing. I'm glad I was near cover. Uh, near cover. Otherwise, I would have gone down in that situation. And those weren't even like elite Geth units. Those were like your normal troopers and uh, hunters, I think. Ah, turrets are gone now. We'll need them anyway, I hope. Let's renew the shield just in case. Okay, so here we have some uh, some more of these data stream things. Right. Looks like we're clear. Now I just need to grab some uh, some of the salvage. Let's do that. Three thousand credits and more credits. Oops. So used to switching weapons on a uh, on the number keys. Wait, what? All right, let's go through. Let's go through. Oh, hello. Oh, that was a fail. I need my uh, armor again. Right, are we clear? With Sever Commander. Got medkit, some ammo. Right on time. Whoa. Black spike. Okay, there's some uh, geth kind of sounds. Ah, okay. Thanks for that, Garrus. Targeting border process. Yes. Ah, perfect. Perfect timing. It's to be uh, pretty simple uh, at the moment. I'll just refresh my armor, just in case. More drones, so I'm assuming we're going to be getting enemies. Let's hack the turrets. Uh, 
Yeah, hack your turrets now, so I get the most out of them. Obviously, if you do that, uh, like, for, oh, the Garrus. Oh, hello. Oh, that was a big hit. So what did the knockback? Well, I didn't even didn't even register anything else shooting at me, except for that hunter, and he didn't go through my shields. How bizarre. Also, Garrus, I don't know why you had to do a whole lap around this area, but I guess you did what you had to do. Right, Medkit, power cells. Ah, now I've got full uh, heavy weapons ammo after everything I spent in, uh, in the re uh, Derelict Reaper mission. That's battle music right there. So. I'm assuming they're gonna be somewhere over here. We've been spotted. I'll light him up. Come on, Legion. Yeah, get behind that corner. Good job. Clean. How large do you suppose that room is? The station is over 15 kilometers long. That room may run the length of it. Damn. It's pretty impressive. Grab some ammo and then bypass, run the bypass on this Geth terminal. And by the looks of things, we're getting attacked. Excellent. Right, that goes there, these go here, and this goes here. This should come in handy. Get shield strength. Nice. That should come in very handy for us. And so that's uh These are some servers I'm assuming. I mean we could blow them up, but I guess that would tip off the the other geth that uh something's going down. Oof. Yeah, pretty sp pretty spiky. PC's feeling pretty spiky today. I really hope I'm not missing a conversation somewhere around here. Ah. So right away there's this uh, thingy web. I'll be careful because this has been very fickle. Sometimes I remember I didn't, not even stepping on it and it still activates. Also, I remember this room was quite difficult to do. Right, let's try it. These guys are down. Still glowing red, so that means. Ah, yeah. Okay, I guess I just need to destroy the hub. Okay. Pretty clear. I don't think there's any other interactions we can do in this room. Moving on. Ah, here we go. Are these processors? Each contains thousands of geth. Can't they see us walking by? They are no more aware of us than you are of cells in your bloodstream. Interesting comparison. Oh. I'll get there. Affirmative. No, you won't get there, Garrus. This isn't like the other hubs we've seen here. This is a database. It contains a portion of the heretic's accumulated memories. Wait. We discovered copies of our current control routes in this database. This suggests the heretics have left times within our networks. 
We wouldn't be here if the heretics wanted to be friends with the Geth. Why wouldn't they spy on you? You do not understand. Organics do not know each other's minds. Geth do. We are not suspicious. We accept each other. The heretics desired to leave. We understood their reasons. We allowed it. There was peace between us. It couldn't have lasted forever. You disagreed about what path your race should take. Human history is a litany of blood shed over different ideals of rulership and afterlife. Geth have no such history. We shared consensus on such things. How could we have become so different? Why can we no longer understand each other? What did we do wrong? Aww. Poor guy. When individuals are separated, they develop in different ways. When they get back together, they don't always get along. If this is the individuality you value, we question your judgment. This topic is irrelevant. We must return to the mission. Have you reached a decision about whether to rewrite the heretics or not? We are still trying to build consensus. Some processes judge destruction preferable, others rewrite. Let's keep moving. Yes. But yeah, uh, it's quite funny how uh, for Legion, the whole idea of uh, individuals um, like individuals having like privacy, I guess. I mean, they're not against individuals because they're each program is an individual, I suppose, uh, for the Geth. But uh, they don't, they aren't too big on, uh, on, I guess, on privacy. It's just how it is. Oh, damn, that's a hole. Uh huh. Good terminal. Okay then. This is it? Yes, we will upload a copy of our runtime into the core. It will delete all copies of the virus. When complete, it will notify us. Okay. The indexing operation will take time. The heretics will respond with force to our upload. We must hold this room. We can override some of the station's internal systems to defend us. Are you ready to begin? Yep. Start your upload, Legion. We'll defend this position. File transfer begun. Shepard Commander, where would you like us to activate defenses? Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Alright, so where are they going to be coming from? Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Hello? Actually. Alert. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. Assuming fortified position. Yep, they cover boys and the wait for them to come up. Damn it! I didn't want to do that, I wanted to take cover. Come on, game. Like, they should be coming up anytime soon. Yep, there they are. I'll light them up. I'm choosing this location because ammo respawns here. Not that one. All right, there are a couple more turrets uh, that can Alert. be overwritten. Heretic runtimes downloading to mobile platforms. All right, the drones found something. Executing pseudo command. Huh. Didn't think that could happen. I call it. You got it. Take cover, boys. Target contact. Wait, need to keep an eye on this hunter. Enemy disabled. There we go. What less to worry about? I don't think there are any more turrets we can use. 
So, Garrus, take up yep, that On position. Perfect. Actually, why not? Moving to cover. Taking cover. Like this is a pretty obvious uh, position. Just, yep, there we go. Here they come. All right, I'll wait for a moment. Recharge that armor. All right, now they're not even taking damage. Brilliant. I think that should be all of them. Oh wait, that's one more. There we go. Data mine and analysis complete. Shepard Commander, it is time to choose. Do we rewrite the heretics or delete them? You don't have any trouble wiping out your own people. Every sapien has the right to make their own decisions. The heretics chose a path that prohibits coexistence. You're letting them make their decisions, then killing them for it? You can't have it both ways, Legion. Their choice was to remove our right to make decisions using this virus. We choose to defend ourselves. Logical. What's to stop them from using the virus later to change themselves back? We will delete the virus after using it. We judge it too dangerous to allow its existence. Good call. Why are you letting me make this decision? They're your people. We are conflicted. There is no consensus among our higher order runtimes. 573 favor rewrite and 571 favor destruction. Shepard Commander, you have fought the heretics. You have perspective we lack. The Geth grant their fate to you. I think that's actually the exact opposite. Since we fought, since we've been fighting the Geth, we wouldn't have perspective because we only fought with uh, the heretics. I mean, sure, okay, now with Legion in the picture, sure, there could be a bit of, uh, sort of, a bit of the other opinion, but it's, uh, I don't know. We will go with the Paragon option, obviously. If they're rewritten, your people will accept them back. Will they even want to go back? They will agree with our judgments in return. We will integrate their experiences. All will be stronger. Take them then. When we get control of the core, release the virus. Acknowledged. Releasing virus. Note, remote access via high gate transmission required. That sounds ominous. The virus will be sent to heretics in nearby star systems. This station will broadcast a powerful electromagnetic pulse through FTL channels. How powerful? Yield in excess of 1.21 petawatts. Alert. EM flux will be hazardous to unshielded organic forms. Addendum. The interior of this station is not shielded. I really wish you'd said that before. Back to the ship. Double time, people. Alright then. Three minutes to make it. Let's rush. Oh. Okay, so there are enemies here. Managed to nail two of them with that one. Gravity's going to well, no, it was it was already going to high health, so really he doesn't stagger from that. And I can't use that cover. Alright, that's that's clean. Sentinel armor back on. Swap to a weapon with ammo. And here, Geth here is somewhere. Oh, baby. That's a prime. down. Yep, they were just getting a weed uh, with all this damage. I'm with you. Following that. Oh, that was it. Okay. Why couldn't we? We've taken that door. We could have just gotten to the core in, in like a couple of uh, couple 
moments. Rewriting of Geth heretics will make main Geth factions significantly more powerful. Given perception of Reapers, they may be possible allies, though long-term cooperation remains unlikely. Regardless, data recovered from Geth Station offered valuable insight into AI social and technological processes. Legion should be committed to the mission after Shepard's help with the Geth heretics. So we gained some experience. We gained uh, Geth Shield Boost, so good. New outfit for Legion, okay. Geth Shield Strength and uh, 15,000 credits and some Palladium. Alright then, mission successful, I assume. <laughs> um, uh, Commander, Tali just went to have a chat with Legion. You better get down to the AI core. I'm on it, Joker. What's going on here? Shepard, I'm glad you're here. I caught Legion scanning my Omni tool. It was going to send data about the flotilla back to the Geth. Creators performed weapons tests and were discussing plans to attack us. We believed it necessary to warn our people. We already made the Geth stronger by rewriting the ones that worship the Reapers. I won't let Legion endanger the fleet by giving them more information. Creator Tally Zora acts out of loyalty to her people. She was willing to be exiled to protect them. We must also protect our people from the Creator threat. You can't let this happen, Shepard. I trusted you, and I worked with a get on the team, but this is too much. All right. So, luckily, we do have a Paragon option for this. Tally, your father was running brutal experiments. If the subjects have been human, I damn well be telling the Alliance about it. I know, but if the Geth find out... They'd attack, which would cause a war that would leave both the Geth and the Quarians vulnerable when the Reapers show up. Is that what you want, Legion? We believed it was necessary to relay the information. Sooner or later, you're both going to have to stop fighting this war. Or we'll all end up paying for it. To facilitate unit cohesion, we will not transmit data regarding creator plans. Thank you, Legion. I understand your intention. What if I gave you some non-classified data to send? We would be grateful. Alright, situation resolved. <laughs> and the big grin on Shepard's face. Seems legit. Alright then, let's go talk to Legion. See if he can um, give us some more insight into the Geth. And, uh, well, how they are. And then we will um, then we will wrap up this video. Shepard. Mm. What happens to the heretics now? They will isolate themselves and reconsider their past judgments. How long will that take? We think at the speed of light. In the time it takes you to voice a question, I can review all my time aboard Normandy. When they have reached new judgments, they will leave their hiding places and return to us. I have questions about the Geth. Specify. Hmm. We need every advantage if this mission is going to succeed. Is there any technology the Geth can share with us? Limited code development is approved. We need to access your FTL comm system to download relevant data. Edie, let Legion through the firewalls for a minute. Very well, Shepard. Hmm. Alright. Prototypes. Geth sniper rifle. Legion gets a widow anti-material rifle. Brilliant. Excellent. Shepard Commander. I have questions about the Geth. Specify. Did Sovereign contact the Geth, or did you seek it out? Nazara, the entity you called Sovereign, signaled us. Like the Geth, the old machine listened to organic radio transmissions. It knew of our war against the Creators. Nazara contacted many species over the millennia, seeking allies. What did you call Sovereign? Nazara. That was what the programs within the Reaper called themselves. Sovereign was a title given by Saren Arterius. Saren and the heretics believed Nazara to be a supreme ruler. A Sovereign. Sovereign was one ship. You're saying there were multiple programs inside it? One ship, one will, many minds, like the Geth. We study your records. Sovereign told you this on Ilos. We are each a nation, independent, free of all weakness. A state compelling to the Geth. We are a nation, but interdependent. Separation is our weakness. Yeah, that is the one weakness of the Geth. 
some of the Geth followed Sovereign. The heretics. The heretics accepted their technology. The old machines offered to give us our future. The Geth will achieve their own future. What difference does it make how you acquire a certain technology? Technology is not a straight line. There are many paths to the same end. Accepting another's path blinds you to alternatives. Nazara, Sovereign, said this itself. Your civilization is based upon the technology of the mass relays, our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. Huh. Good point, actually. I'm surprised you can speak. The Geth I fought before just made a stuttering sound. We prefer direct digital transfer. Geth network communication travels at light speed. Human hardware does not support this method. Your analog oral communication is inefficient. Thanks. Do Geth have a government? Not as you understand. We are all Geth. We build consensus. Most governments do. Organic governments impose consensus. From a single point of view in autocracies. By codifying the most broadly acceptable average of views in democracies. So what makes the Geth different? Data is shared between Geth. All viewpoints are considered. Consensus is achieved as data is disseminated. That must take a long time. It would for organics. We communicate at the speed of light. It always comes down to that. <laughs> so we've covered all these. Another I'd like to ask about something else. Ready. I'd like to find out more about you. We are building a consensus. Please try again later. Wow, okay. I have to get back to work. Acknowledged. Okay, so um, I think this is where we're going to stop. Let's see the journal. So we have stopped collectors. Complete recruitment and N7 missions while Normandy crew installs the Reaper IFF. That's the thing. I don't have any N7 missions or recruitment missions left. Uh, the last one I did was... Uh, well, the last two I did were both to get Legion. Which was, I guess, the Reaper IFF mission was the recruitment one. And, uh, yeah, now that I'm done with the loyalty one as well, we really don't have anything. So, um... The IFF is nearly installed, Shepard. However, I must test its impact on the Normandy systems. I suggest you take a shuttle to access your next location. Actually, I'm thinking this is, uh, something where I need to do a non-story mission. Something, a mission that's not essential to this, uh, story. To, um to progress, to actually progress the story, which uh, doesn't make sense. But yeah, unfortunately I don't have any of those left, but uh, remembering from my past experiences, this is actually a pretty good thing. Why? Uh, you'll see uh, further down the line. But I think I'll just uh, do some traveling around. Uh, I'll probably go and look for, uh, for some of the tech, uh, for some of the upgrades uh, that I may have left behind, speaking of which. Let's uh, roll on over to the lab and quickly pick up that uh, research. Uh, Geth Shield Strength. And that's two out of two as well. So, Squad members with Geth Shielding receive shields plus 50% strength. Alright, uh, let's check the out. The yes, I heard you, Edie. Alright, Legion. Uh, he can. Ah, he can go white and red. Uh, I, I prefer the black one. Upgrades, no, unread messages, let's see, what do we have? Encrypted transmission. Yep, he's pleased he was able to recover the Reaper IFF. I've been notified about the intact get and your decision to keep it. If you believe it can be trusted, then go ahead and activate it. Just make sure the ED is adequately protected. I just need to get the job done, whatever it takes. Oh, red. Mark is red. Alright then. So we're going to stop here, and in the next video, we're going to try and trigger the continuation of the story, which is which we're pretty much finished with it. There are, I think, only two main story missions left. So, um, yeah, we're very close to the end. That main story and arrival, pretty much. Uh, that's it. Uh, but yeah, for today, that's going to be it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then feel free to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. If you leave a like or a comment, that will be much appreciated. And also don't forget that the channel has Twitter and Facebook pages, as well as a Twitch uh, channel. Uh, so you can uh, uh, you can check the links out uh, in the description of this video. And in terms of the Twitch channel, 
uh, just uh, try uh, keep following my Twitter. I will be posting there about the stream times on uh, weekday evenings. Yeah, uh, that's pretty much gonna be it. So thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.